Hey, what's up guys? Ali here from iSocialU.com and welcome back to my channel. In this video today, we're going to talk about how do you schedule your Instagram stories. Yes, stories, not just the feed posts. Before we jump into the video, you know what to do. Subscribe, hit the bell icon and also like this video. All right, now let's jump right into this. So first of all, the tool that I use to do this, I'm going to share the tool and also the process with you. The tool that I use for Instagram story scheduling is called Tailwind. And I'm going to have a link in the description below, which is my affiliate link. So you can check this out. But here's the thing. Tailwind, actually, you can do a lot more than just scheduling your Instagram stories. You can schedule your photos, videos from your desktop, one-click hashtag suggestion. So imagine hashtags for every single post. And also, this tool calculates the best time to post on your uh, Instagram. So this tool really is a powerhouse when it comes to growing your Instagram. Again, the link is going to be in the description below. All right, now let's look at the step-by-step -step process of scheduling your Instagram stories. And one note, so you do need this tool Tailwind on your computer, on your desktop, and also on your mobile phone in order to schedule to your Instagram stories. If you want to schedule just to the to the feed, then you don't need it on your mobile device. But if you want to do the scheduling for your Instagram stories, because we're going to do the push notification, then you do need this on your iPhone or Android. All right. Now, I do have an account, so I'm going to just click on the dashboard and uh, log right into this. And obviously... Uh, make sure you connect your Instagram account, which I already have. So here's my Instagram account at alimirza2k. Uh, this account is already connected uh, inside my Tailwind uh, tool. All right, now, once your tool is, once your Instagram uh, account is connected to the tool Tailwind, what you want to do is click on right here, Publisher, and then click on the Drafts. And right now, I don't have any drafts, so but let's go and uh, bring upload a photo or a video and yes you can schedule both or either one the photo or the video so i'm going to click on this and actually before i do that look at this so here are the best tools uh best times to post on my instagram based on my audience that's actually something that i really like about tailwind i think they do a really good job of figuring out the best time to post for every single account it's, it is different what's best for best time for post for me is going to be different for you for your client a for your client b for everyone all right now let's go back to upload photos and videos and i'm gonna bring in um right here so this is an image i want to schedule to my Instagram stories, not the feed. So we're gonna look at this, and here you go. So now, to in order to schedule it to my stories, I'm not gonna add any caption to it. So I'm gonna leave the caption, here's the image that I want. So caption is blank, I'm, I don't wanna pick any hashtags. Here's the most important thing you have to remember. So post method. So by default, it's auto post. What this means is it's going to automatically post this on your Instagram and it's going to go to your feed, but we do not want that. So what I want to do is change it to the notification. So now what's going to happen is it's going to send a notification to my phone. And that's why in order to schedule to your Instagram stories, you need this app Tailwind on your mobile device as well. And you can download it easily from your app store or Google play store. All right. So I, uh, very important, do not leave it to the auto post. So change it to the notification post. And then let's pick a time. So you can pick the best time or to, for the purpose of this demo, I'm gonna pick, uh, let's say, what time is it right now? So 4.34. So let me change it to uh, 4.36. Set the custom time. And then posts have been saved. And now I'm gonna hit schedule. And look at this, so it is scheduled to be posted uh, at 4.36. At that time, I'm gonna get a notification. So let's wait and I'll show you how that notification looks like. All right, so when it's time to post on your Instagram, you're gonna see that notification that just popped up uh, right here, like this, time to post to your Instagram. So I'm gonna open that notification now. Let's click on that and open, and it's basically gonna open uh, my Tailwind dashboard right here. So let me click on, let's click on that right here. And now I want to say, click on post now. Let's do this. And it's going to say, sharing to Instagram. That's fine. 
And now this is where the magic happens. So instead of posting it to your feed, what you're gonna do, post it or click on the story right here. And now it's uploaded to your, or added to your Instagram stories. And this is where you're able to add any location tags or hashtags or any other stickers that you do wanna add. Maybe even like music to totally up to you. So you can add all that cool stuff. And then when you are ready, all you have to do is click on your story, uh, your stories, and it will be added to your stories. So look at that. It's added. Let's go back and check it. So I'm going to go to my stories. It's uploading still. So. There you go. So it is now added on my Instagram story. So this is how you use a tool called uh, Tailwind and again the link is going to be in the description below so make sure you go check it out uh, to schedule your content to uh, schedule your Instagram stories from desktop and yeah we kind of use the workaround instead of sending it to the feed we're sending it to the stories but very easily a lot of people want to save time when it comes to creating content or publishing content on Instagram stories so check out Tailwind for sure and again before you go if you have any questions you know what to do right leave those questions below in the comments and also make sure you subscribe hit the bell icon and also like this video I'm gonna see you in the next one bye for now